follow this guy, to their underwater air bubble room. The structure you see, is their dome, in the midst of the water. As God, placed our firmament, in the midst of the water. The movement you see through the dome, is the water moving, under the dome. There is air and water under the dome here, as there is air and water, under the firmament of our reality. And God said, Let there be a firmament in the midst of the waters, and let it divide the waters from the waters. And God made the firmament and divided the waters which were under the firmament from the waters which were above the firmament. And it was so. And God called the firmament heaven. And the evening and the morning were the second day. So here you see the placement of a curved structure. A dome, God called the firmament, which he placed in water, with water under the firmament, as well as water above the firmament. The firmament God made is as a terrible crystal, and clear as molten glass. As you can see, from God's point of view, he can look down through the clear water, above our clear firmament, and see us. Scripture says, It is he that sitteth upon the circle of the earth, and the inhabitants thereof are as grasshoppers, that stretcheth out the heavens as a curtain, and spreadeth them out as a tent to dwell in. What you are seeing now, from the waters above the firmament, and looking through the firmament, are we, as grasshoppers, in the sight of God. Now, we have the dome, fashioned by man, in the midst of the waters, and anchored on the bottom of the sea. And the swimmers, will emerge out of the waters, under the dome, into the air in the dome. Likewise, as the earth emerged out of the waters, under the firmament, into the air in the firmament, on the third day. And man, took his first breath, in the firmament, on the sixth day. And God said, Let the waters under the heaven be gathered together into one place, and let the dry land appear. And it was so. And God called the dry land earth, and the gathering together of the waters called he seas. So picture these people, coming up out of the water, into the atmosphere, under the dome. As the earth coming out of the water, into the atmosphere, under the firmament. And when we look up into the firmament, we see the blue waters above the firmament. Just as they are seeing the blue waters, above their dome. As I said, this was a short video to give the viewers, a working idea of how the firmament made by God, resembles this underwater dome, made by men. Our earth, our air, our sun, moon, and stars, and everything that has breath, resides in, and underwater. Hope this was helpful. And thanks for watching. Also, thank you guys for sharing your post.